Who will solve the puzzle first? This is a very unique experiment. Here is a group of humans and here is a group of ants. Each group must work together to move a bulky object through a maze. During the experiment, the scientists varied the size of the group. When it was just an individual or a smaller group, the humans were much faster than ants. When it was a larger group, it didn't mean that people were any faster at completing the puzzle. Actually, they spent a lot of time sitting around discussing and deciding on the next move. And for part of the experiment, the humans were not allowed to talk or gesture and they had to wear sunglasses and masks. The only way that they could communicate was by pushing or pulling the object. And under these conditions, they really struggled to complete the puzzle. On the other hand, the ants performed better when they were in larger groups. They demonstrated something called collective memory, which is where they help each other to avoid past mistakes or keep moving in a direction that's helpful. This experiment shows how simple minds can work together to be even smarter than individuals. But for complex minds, that's not necessarily the case.